Hello everyone, happy Croctober. My name is Bobby Greco. I am a PhD student at Clemson University in the US and I work with American Crocodile or Crocodilus acutus in Lago Enriquillo, Dominican Republic. Now this is a very unique system. It's a very large hypersaline lake in southwestern Dominican Republic that historically had a very large population of American Crocodile with over 500 breeding adults. S right around the 1980s is when that population started to decline for various reasons, including overhunting, indiscriminate killing, um, fishing uh, activities, uh, them being caught as bycatch, uh, especially with gill nets, and then we, uh, and habitat destruction as well. So my research, as well as my colleagues, is surrounded by um, figuring out ways to recover this population. Um, this includes a, initiating a Head Start program, which we started in 2023. And my research investigates uh, optimal conditions for Head Start programs. And we'll also look into uh, post, uh, post Head Start release of crocodiles, so are they behaving like uh, wild conspecifics of the same cohort? Are they surviving at the same rate? Are they eating the same thing? So on and so forth. Um, besides that, we are trying to learn as much life history information as we can, so we are doing various things such as uh, community and population dynamics, uh, home range selection and other resource selection, uh, diet research, and uh, ecotoxicology, including uh, mercury analysis. And then simultaneously with all of our research, we are um, working with communities, uh, local communities, as well as local rangers in training so they can help us with monitoring when we are not in the area. And all of this will culminate into long-term uh, management and recovery of the population. So keep an eye out on our work. Uh, we're just getting started here and uh, we're going to have plenty to show you guys. Um, additionally, we will be uh, trying to get, we're trying to get started a uh, internship program so students from around the world can come out and uh, help us and gain experience uh, firsthand on a conservation project. And uh, it'll also help fund the project as well. So uh, if you'd like more information, please reach out and uh, stay tuned. We have uh, much work to do. Thank you.